occupied bed. Making an occupied bed is done to provide comfort for the client, to maintain a hygienic environment, to reduce transmission of microorganisms, to refresh the client, and to conserve the client's energy. Equipment needed. One pillow, one pillowcase, one top sheet, one draw sheet, one rubber sheet, one bottom sheet, a blanket, and a trolley hamper. Procedure. Assemble the equipment and place on bedside chair in order of use. Organization promotes efficient time management. Explain the procedure to the client. Check the chart for limitation on the client's physical activity. It facilitates client cooperation and determines his level of activity. Wash your hand and wear appropriate PPE if necessary. This ensures that the healthcare provider is safe from any discharges present in the soiled linens. Close the door or curtain to provide privacy. Adjust the bed to the high position. Lower the side rail nearest you, leaving the opposite side rail up. Place in flat position if the client can tolerate it. Having the bed on the high position reduces strain on the nurse. Having the mattress flat facilitates me a wrinkle-free bed. Check the client for the client's personal items and disconnect the call bell or any tube from the bed linen. It is costly and inconvenient when personal items are lost. Disconnecting tubes from linen prevents discomfort and accidental dislodging of tubes. Place the bath blanket, if available, over the client. Have him hold onto the bath blanket while you reach under it and remove top linen. Leave the top sheet in place if the bath blanket is not in use. Fold linen that is to be reused over the back of the chair. Discard soiled linens in a laundry bag. Provides warmth and privacy. Grasp the mattress securely and shift it up to the head of the bed. Allows more foot room for the client and positions the mattress against the head of the bed. Then loosen the bottom linen from the head and side of the bed. It facilitates removal of linen. Assist the client to turn toward the opposite side of the bed and reposition the pillow under his head. It allows the bed to be made on the vacant side.
Fan fold the soil linen as close to the client as possible. This facilitates removal of linen when the client turns to the other side. Use clean linen and make the near side of the bed following steps 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9 in making an unoccupied bed. Fan fold linen as close to the client as possible. This facilitates proper organiz organization while putting the sheets in the bed.
Raise the side rail. Move to the other side and lower the side rail. Assist the client to roll over folded linen behind him or her and toward the other side. Reposition the pillow and back blanket or top sheet. This ensures client safety. Roll look soiled sheet one by one and remove. Place in the linen bag. Hold the soiled linen away from the uniform. Proper disposal of soiled linen prevents the spread of microorganisms. Ease the clean linen from under the client. Pull taut and secure bottom sheet under the head of the mattress. Mitre the corner. Pull the inside of the sheet taut and tuck it under the inside or the side of the mattress. Repeat with draw sheet. Remove the wrinkles and creases in linen which are uncomfortable to lie on.
assist the client to return to the center of the bed. Remove the pillow and change the pillow cases before replacing the pillow on the bed, with the open end facing away from the entrance. This is to provide a neater appearance. Then apply the top linen so that it is centered and the top hems are even with the head of the mattress. Have the client hold onto the top linen so the bath bank blanket can be removed. This allows bottom hands to be tucked securely under the mattress and provides for privacy. Secure the top linen under the foot of the mattress and miters the corners. Loosen the top linen over the client's feet by grasping them in the area of feet and pulling gently towards the foot of the bed. This provides neat appearance. Loosening linen over the client's feet gives more room for movement. Raise the side rail, lower the bed height and adjust the head of the bed to a comfortable position. We attach the call bell and drainage tubes. This provides for the client's safety. Bring the soiled linen to the utility room or dispose according to the hospital policy. Wash your hands. Prevent spread of microorganisms. 